Hey everybody, it's me, Karen Buford. <laughs> I have this above my table so that I can film it. I know it looks really weird, but um, I'm gonna add some decorations to this because this is nice, but it needs something down here. And so one of my friends, Maria Todd Robertson, I think that's her name, um, decided, I showed her the picture and she said, oh, you could just add some gold chain. And I thought, yeah, that's a great idea. So uh, I'm gonna add some gold chain. I'm gonna use hot glue, which here's my hot glue gun. And this Gorilla Glue, Super Glue brush and nozzle. Um, so supposedly it sets in 10 seconds, but I have the hot glue just in case. And then I have some little embellishments that I wanna add in here. Went to Michael's. And I got these things on sale. So here's some little blue flowers with really cool um, little beads in them. And here's some pink ones, light pink, that are kind of uh, see-through with like that tulle or chiffon fabric. And then these are just like silk ones that are um, have the beads. And I also got these. I don't know if I'll use these or not, but there's some kind of little roses. Pink ribbon with uh, sparklies in it to match my sparkly on there. And gold chain. So um, we'll see how long this takes. Um, how long this video is going to be. And I'm going to take out put these over to the side for now. Back in my little container. Lose them. And I'll decide where that's going to go. But I do want to give her a little pink ribbon like this on this gold chain. So I might give her like two chains or something because it's kind of thin now that I'm looking at it. I don't want it real fat though. So hopefully that will match my gold earring. Let's see if we can get this off of here. don't know where this chain, how long it is or anything. It says 96 inches. So that's quite a bit of chain. I can use this for lots of things. But of course it's not going to be kept so nicely. Let's get all this stuff off of here because it doesn't need to take up that much space. Hopefully it won't get tangled up later on. So the next time I want to use it, hopefully it will not be tangled. If it is, it shouldn't be too much. It's not like I'm, I don't know, I probably won't use too much of it, but who knows? You never know what you're going to do in the future. Until it arrives. Okay, so let's see if I can find the end for this. There's one end. See? Sorry, tangled up. <laughs> Already. Lovely, I'm so loving it. And I have this video um, hanging in a basket that, you know, one of those wire baskets that you can put in your closet or your pantry. And um, I've got a hate, I hate tangles. I hate knots and tangles. But my solution to knots and tangles is to cut it. I can't really do that with this. Yeah, I should have took my time. It's okay though. I think I, I think I have it. So let's see. Note to self. Never untangle it. Never do it like this again. Just carefully take the thing out. Pay attention to what you're doing. Because I see it's got knots everywhere. So I'm trying to get down to the bottom. Oh my god, that's so irritating. see I can't really see where this ends and begins and all that to really untangle it well and it just makes my brain hurt reminds me of map oh there's the end oh, ho, ho, ho. yay <gasps> Woohoo! let's see if we got it untangled or not I'm gonna carefully go through this oh my god this could have so been avoided there we go. Close enough. So it 
just had to make a big knot at the end. Let's see if I can get it all the way down. Oh my gosh. I will probably have to cut this from the video because this is too stupid. But it does show you that, you know, there. Oh, thank you, God. Okay, so I have to find something else to put this on. And I'm thinking to wrap it around a card or something that's a little bit thicker. So I have somebody's card over here. I don't know who these people are. Authentic Indian Jewelry. Hmm. Maybe not. I might want that later. Um, I'm trying to think if I have any kind of... <gasps> oh, you know what? <laughs> Is it still here? No. Um, hmm. I thought I had an extra one. I have a little extra magnet that it would just stick to. But I'm going to see if, it'll, if this one will work. I have this little magnet. It's pretty El Cheapo, but hopefully it'll work. Of course it doesn't stick to that. Why would it stick to that? Whatever. This will work though. And then I can like attach this to something. Let me see how much of this chain I want to use. So I might want it to go like this. Maybe I give her a double-sided chain like this. And I just want to attach the ends to the black part so I think right there is gonna be good now I get to figure out how to um, get rid of the extra parts so I'm gonna take my glasses off so I can see this is very tiny and I have a pair of jewelry um, pliers that I'm gonna try to wiggle this through and create some kind of knot see if I can get this through this little link because I know that all these links, yep, they have a place where they come together. So I just have to loosen one of them. There we go. Got that one. Okay, so now I get to try and put it back. I'm not even going to try to put it back together. I'm just going to throw it away. Because I don't need that. Okay, so here's my, um, oh, it looks like it sort of stuck not really anyway I'm gonna put this up against something metallic that's the one I have those I didn't have those metallic is uh, oh dang it that's the one I needed okay never mind okay let's see if it'll stick nope didn't want to stick all right well whatever I'll put it over here for now and then here I'm going to try and straighten out this chain because it seems like, there we go. Straighten it out, get all the little kinks out. And then my hot glue gun. I don't know how this is going to work. I'm going to see how it works. Because, oh, ooh, oh, wow. Stuff is coming out already. Okay, so I'm going to put that on here. I don't know if it was under pressure or what. But let's see if I can this up and put the end on here where I want it to be right there okay so we'll see if that works and then I should put the end here so I think I put that up too high so it should be down here now but that's okay with that. Um, I don't know if that's going to work, but that could be a thing. Mm, I'm looking at it. I kind of don't like it. So, let's see if I can. Oh, it does work. Oh, 10 seconds. It does work. Yeah. Okay. But now it's dripping all over. So, I think I want to put it here instead. And lay my little chain in there. the second time it's not as much I've got a few more seconds to work with this before it sticks no oh my gosh Let's see if I can get it down oh jeez 
because my fingers are stuck. It's stuck to my fingers, but that's just not a thing. This is going to be an interesting video. There we go. I think I have it. No, I don't have it yet. Let that dry a little bit. See if I can undo it before. Let's see. There we go. Oh, I just guess I needed to glue a few of them together. Then I can glue them down. Okay, and I'll put another drop of this super glue. I'm so glad somebody came up with super glue I can use that doesn't have like a horrible odor that gives me an asthma attack. Really, really happy with that. Um, I may or may not need my um, hot glue, but we'll see. Okay, yeah, I like this better, and I want it to kind of kind of curve around. Because when this, while it's flat, it's going to not look the same. Okay, so I think I want it to do that. And then do I have enough room to go back over? No. Okay, so I have to make this a shorter run to get this to come back to the original point. I want her to have two chains, so I'm going to put that one there. Put another little drop of glue. Sorry if my head's in the way. Let's see if I can get the drop to come out. Oh yeah, now it don't want to come out. Okay. So I put a drop there. Let that set for a little bit. No fumes. This is the best stuff. Gorilla Glue. Um, Gorilla Glue Super Glue with brush and nozzle. So I might use the brush and the nozzle when I start to make my little flowers. But in the meantime, while I'm waiting for that to dry, I'm going to set out some of these flowers and see where I want to put them. So. Because I really like some of these. So I'll put out a few of these and they can go in certain places, like maybe they can go on the blue ones. I don't think they'll make it on the pink. Maybe I'll just put that one on a couple here and there, and then I'll put the blue ones, or the dark pink ones, on the big, I think I'm going to put a dark, big dark pink one here. And I have some little tiny blue ones that I can put here with my painted ones. Let's see what this dark pink looks like. I don't think I want that. two pink flowers. And I, I didn't, didn't have purple. Otherwise, I would have got purple. But I didn't have it. So. And these were on sale. So I was like, oh yeah, cool. On sale. I can do that. So maybe I'll put a little tiny blue one here. A little tiny blue one there. Oh yeah, I like that. <gasps> but I have yellow and nothing to put in the yellow. Hmm. Maybe I can put some of these in the yellow flowers. Uh, kind of hard to see. Hmm. I don't know. Uh, I just have these three kinds. So let me see how it looks with the blue. Over here. Yeah. I don't know about that. I kind of want to put one there, but. See, that's going to need something bigger, so maybe I'll use the pink on the yellow, too, because I kind of like that. That's kind of nice. That's okay. Yeah, so I have three pink, three dark pink, two light pink, and two of the blues. Three of the blues. One, two, oh, four. One, two, three, four. Um, let me see how this dark pink looks here. Jeez, I think I like that better. I 
think I do. Um, let me see if this light pink will go better with this purple. <gasps> oh, I like that. Mm, nice. I think I'm going to go with that. Um, yeah, because I have the little blues on different, so I have only have two of those now. That's so small. This one looks a little bit bigger. Let's see how that looks. Mm. Mm. I have to think about it and look at it. I think this is what I want to do with this. And then I could maybe put a few of those on the chain as well. Let's see if I can get this chain in some kind of reasonableness. I did these flowers type deal with um, my Buddha painting, and that sold right away. Like, I was kind of sad that my Buddha painting sold. I mean, I was glad that it sold, but I was still kind of sad. Because I really liked it. So sometimes, let me put some glue here. Sometimes when I sell paintings, I'm not really ready to sell them. Okay, so that should stick there. And then I'm going to see if I can make this ribbon. Which, what is the ribbon? Because I want her to have like an actual pink ribbon. So I might put it in between. Um, oh. I wonder if I could put it on one of these. Ooh, that's